Hi reception, it's Mrs Scott here. I know that you've been working really hard at home this week, so well done. And I thought, as it's Friday and it's nearly the end of the day, you might like to listen to a story together. So here goes. It's a story that I think you'll know because we have this story in our classroom at school. I wonder if anybody can remember what the title of my book is. That's right, it's called Handa's Surprise. And it's about this little girl here who's called Handa. The book is written by Eileen Brown. Handa put seven delicious fruits in a basket for her friend, Akio. There are the fruits that she's putting in her basket. Can you see what fruit she's putting in? I can see a big spiky pineapple and I can also see a ripe yellow banana but what other fruits are in the basket I wonder if you can tell me what some of the fruits are does anybody know what this one here is that's right that's called an avocado sometimes I like to have an avocado for my lunch what about this little one here does anybody know what that is and what about this one hiding at the back with the leaf on the top? That's right, that's an orange. She will be surprised, thought Handa, as she set off for Akio's village. How is Handa carrying the fruit to her friend Akio? That's right, she's put them in a basket. And how is she carrying the basket? She's carrying it on her head. She must be very clever because she's not even using her hands to make sure it doesn't wobble. Well done, Handa. I wonder which fruit she'll like best. Will she like the soft yellow banana? But oh dear, I can see somebody hiding in the tree who thinks that they might like the soft yellow banana. Who has come to take Handa's banana out of her basket. That's right, it's a cheeky monkey. Or will she like the sweet smelling guava? But oh dear, somebody else has got their eye on the sweet smelling guava. Who is coming to take the guava out of Handa's basket? That's right, it's an ostrich. And there it is, taking the fruit. So the banana's gone and the guava's gone. I wonder how many fruits Handa has got left in her basket. Can you remember how many she had at the beginning? That's right, she had seven. So she started with seven and now two have been taken away. I wonder how many she's got left. Can you use your fingers to work it out? Can you show me what seven looks like on your fingers? Shall we do it together? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's right. And if you take two away, one, two, how many have you got left? You're right, you've got five. Will Akio like the round, juicy orange? Well, I don't know whether Akio will, but I can certainly see somebody who's got their eye on the round juicy orange. Who has come to take it? What a cheeky zebra. Or will she like the ripe red mango? But oh dear, I don't think Akio will get to see the ripe red mango because look who's come to take it. That's right, it's the elephant. Will she like the spiky leaved pineapple? I don't know, somebody does. Who's come to take the spiky leaved pineapple? Oh, that's right, it's the giraffe with its long licky tongue. The giraffe takes the pineapple away. Can you see how many fruits will be left? There's one there and then there's one just hiding next to it. Or will she like the creamy green avocado? But oh no, 
somebody's come to take that one as well. Or the tangy purple passion fruit. Can you see who's come to take the tangy purple passion fruit? That's right, it's a really cheeky bird. Which fruit will Akio like best? Can you see what's happening in this picture here? There's a goat. That's right, it's a goat and it's broken away from where it's being tied up and it's running and running and running and look, it's headbutting the tree. And as it's headbutting the tree, what's happening to all the fruit on the branches? That's right, they're falling into Handa's basket. Hello, Akio, said Handa. I brought you a surprise. 